Another investigation underway after a Wells Fargo employee died while on the job. 12 News journalist Jade Cunningham spoke with an employee who's raising questions about how Wells Fargo handled this whole thing. Jade. There's sadness at this Wells Fargo in Tempe. It's really, really heartbreaking. And I'm thinking, what if I were just sitting there? Like, nobody would check on me. After the body of an employee was found at work, an associate who asked to remain anonymous for fear of retaliation says the situation is troubling. Her boss had emailed her. He didn't receive a response. So they went to go check where she normally sits and that's how they found the body. Tempe police say on August 20th, building security called authorities after finding a worker who was possibly dead. Officers went and identified the person as 60-year-old Denise Prudhomme. To hear that she's just been sitting at the desk, like that would make me feel like sick and that nobody did anything. That was how she spent her last moments. Police say there's nothing suspicious about the death, but still haven't confirmed many details about the time or manner of it. The employee says the lack of information from the bank has been especially frustrating. I'm just wondering like, why they didn't formally address employees about it when this does affect everybody in the building. Wells Fargo said in a statement, we are deeply saddened by the tragic loss of our colleague at our Tempe office. It also states counselors are available to support employees and all further questions will be directed to police. I just feel like they aren't being transparent with us and somebody needs to acknowledge this. To the family, yeah, I am very, very sorry for their loss. I, like I said, I, I can just... I feel it because I'm thinking about my mom, my mother-in-law, if that had happened to them.